Okay, this is Eve Eternity with Wrath of Kronos, and now we're on map 10, which is called Creation, and we gotta get moving right now, because there is a lot of shit heading our way. But I mean, look at this place. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Stunningly so. Let's just gather whatever we can before we start fighting. And I'll just give you a little tour of the place. I mean, look at how many fucking enemies are in this place. <laughs> Jesus. Ooh, boots are nice. Alright. Uh, let's find a good place to start fighting. Ooh, there's a chest in here, too. I was hoping to keep that going. Oh well. Uh, speaking of keeping things going, let's actually survive and drink a potion. Okay. Okay. Oh, you scared me there, clone. Let's use this chest key. Ooh! That's gonna come in handy later. I'll tell you that much. Now, this is the final level of the chapter, in case you haven't noticed, since, you know, every chapter is five levels, so we're on map ten. So that's the final level of the second chapter. Oh shit, hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> he went flying, Jesus. No, 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 no. No, you are not allowed to live at all. Okay, hang on. We're backing up a little bit here. Eh, I'm not ready for the Crater of Might yet. I do have all these black flasks. Where did they come from? That is just lovely. I might use those at some point. Possibly very soon, because uh, this level gets big. It's quite a large level to fight through. Ooh, mana. Mana's good. I do like it. There's also this area up here, and possibly all those flasks that we may want. Oh, we want all of this. Absolutely. Good lord, that music. It's amazing. Oh shit, this is not amazing though. This is, this is the Hari Bell. Oof. Survive though. Here's the music, man. do your disappearing act. At least he comes right back, right? I mean, in Texan 2, those things are dicks. But, alright, we're gonna max out Shadow Walk. More health. Okay. A lot of bad out there. Hang on, let's see how we want to handle this. That'll help a little bit.
nope, nope, you're on my side. Right. There is some ammo around here, I'm pretty sure, in this maze of stuff. So we're going to explore a little bit and see what we can find. Oh, hi. Uh, we're going to do something a little more powerful for you. feeling. Terrible, terrible feeling that was going to happen. Alright. It's alright. We're not too far behind. Thankfully. Oh. You need to watch her ass a little bit. that vampire. Where are you? There is a vampire out there. I heard him. I definitely heard him. Alright. We could try to go in here. Although if we are, we're definitely going to activate that. I think we're also going to activate this. Oh, here we go. Wait. Is it not here? Oh, there you are. Hi, Korax. Oh, we're doing decent enough damage against him. Yes, crush yourself. Good. That was a good job, Korax. Oh, no, no, no. Don't crush me, though. That's all I ask. Oh, yeah, like that. Don't do that. Oh. Okay. Oh, he froze one of my guys. Well fought, minions. Well fought, indeed. Okay. Uh, more agility, then. Now, if there's a way... Yes, there is, in fact, a way up there. Beautiful. I believe he dropped some supplies... Oh, no, maybe not. What supplies he did drop is probably long gone now. Alright, we did, in fact, hit that. Good. Okay. Oof. I believe there is a switch in here we do have to find somewhere. I just don't actually remember where it is. Or there's all of this.
You notice how some of the uh, computer monitors are getting a little demonic. Or computer monitors, I don't even know what that face is and what is this technology? I am but a mere assassin from the medieval ages. Oh, hi there. I have no clue what any of this technology is, of course. Oh, oh lord. That's bad. No, 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 no. We won't be having any of that resurrection nonsense. Thank you very much, though. Appreciate it. But we're good. We, we don't need any here. Thanks. We're good. Oh, Jesus. That is a clusterfuck. That is like, if you go in the dictionary, that is exactly what you see. Okay, now that is a new enemy. That is, um... Oh, I can select a path, even. Hang on. Go do that real quick. Find some safety to do so. Uh, that is a horrible, horrible thing out there, though. Um, okay, so now I get to actually show you how the pathway works. Well, really, you just go to this now that we're level 15, and you just choose Confirm Specialization. All right, so now we have Shadow Walk boost duration increase to three seconds. Uh, we also gain Shadow Damage increase when we're in low light areas, and Night Clone summons an additional clone, which is very nice. All right, um... Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh. Although our tour of the pathways may be ever so brief because I think we're basically at the end here. summon something else to fight. Plenty of things in that maze, but I think I'm gonna have to hold off on that. Ugh. All right. Well, we're pretty much at the end of the episode if we walk through these portals. So, man, let's just go ahead and end our run with the assassin then. There we go. There you go. The assassin class. Oh, you know what? Hang on. Hang on. I didn't get to show you this. Hang on. Give weapons. I promised I would do this. All right. Hang on. Blah 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 blah. Vorpal, no, 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 no. Okay, hang on. Crossbow, I showed you. I showed that. I showed off the shrapnel grenades. Now this, here it is. This is the assassin's ultimate weapon. It's called the, what was it? The Deathbringer Arbalest. Primary fire does this. You can kind of hold it down indefinitely, I believe. Launch a little blast like that. Let's see if I can actually find a target for this, though. That'd be nice. I know there was somebody around here. Anybody here want to get blasted? Anybody? Well, you certainly do. Oh, are you? 365 frickin' damage. I mean, look at that bullshit. But that's not all, friends. Uh, of course, it has an alternate fire. Which, uh, let's see here. I think this actually just does... Yeah. Whoa, I forgot it did that. Holy crap. Yes, it bounces off of walls. Hold on, let's do that in the closed environment. <laughs> the bounces don't last very long, but man. See how much damage that bad boy does. Hold on. Where is that enemy? Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Well, you, you'll you work just fine. Goes through enemies, apparently. Good to know. Good lord. Yeah, quite a nice little item. Nice little weapon, I must say. The bouncing is a nice touch, I must admit. Very nice. I'm, I'm quite a fan. I believe... Yeah, I think we've seen all the weapons then. 
Well, there you go. All right. That's the end of our assassin run. Apparently, we're in darkness. If you look at the top right corner there, that meant we were in a low light area, which meant we were doing more shadow damage for a moment there. Anyway, how'd we do? Found zero secrets, as per usual. Well, that's the end of chapter two, and that's the end of our assassin run. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next chapter of Eve Eternity with Wrath of Kronos. All right, later.